is primitive camping safe? So you're thinking about trying primitive camping. It can be a really fun and rewarding experience, but there are some risks that come with it. What is primitive camping? Primitive camping is basically any form of camping that doesn't involve using developed campsites or facilities. This means that you're generally more likely to find yourself in a beautiful natural setting, without the crowds or noise that can often come with more developed campgrounds. Of course, primitive camping also comes with its own set of challenges. Without access to running water or flush toilets, you'll need to be prepared to rough it a bit. But for many campers, that's all part of the appeal. If you're looking for an adventure, primitive camping is definitely the way to go. What are some of the dangers associated with primitive camping? For the uninitiated, primitive camping may seem like a fun and adventurous way to spend a weekend in the great outdoors. However, there are a few dangers associated with this type of camping that should be considered before embarking on your trip. First of all, without the comforts of modern amenities, you may find yourself quite uncomfortable after a few days in the wilderness. In addition, without access to clean water or medical care, minor injuries can quickly become serious health concerns. Finally, depending on the area you are camping in, you may be at risk for encounters with dangerous wildlife. While primitive camping can be a great way to connect with nature, it is important to be aware of the risks involved. How do you choose a safe campsite for primitive camping? When primitive camping, you need to be aware of your surroundings at all times and choose a safe campsite. The first step is to find a spot that is far enough away from any bodies of water, including rivers, lakes, and ponds. Staying dry is essential to staying safe in the wilderness. Second, you will want to choose a level spot that is clear of debris. This will help you avoid obstacles and tripping hazards in the dark. Third, make sure to select a spot that is out of the wind. This will protect you from the elements and help keep your fire contained. Finally, pick a location that is far from any large trees or branches. Falling branches can be dangerous. Primitive camping can be a great way to get back to nature and enjoy some peace and quiet. However, there are a few things you need to keep in mind in order to stay safe. First, make sure you have a good map of the area and know where you're going. It's also important to let someone know where you'll be, just in case anything happens. Once you're at your campsite, set up your tent away from any potential hazards like dead trees or cliffs. And of course, never leave your fire unattended. If you follow these simple safety tips, you'll be sure to have a fun and safe primitive camping experience. Primitive camping can be a safe and fun experience as long as you take the necessary precautions. Do your research ahead of time to familiarize yourself with some of the potential dangers and how to avoid them. When choosing a campsite, prioritize safety over accessibility or aesthetics. And finally, remember to have fun. Primitive camping is a great way to connect with nature and slow down the pace of life for a little while. What are your thoughts on primitive camping? Leave us a comment below and let us know if you have any tips or tricks for staying safe in the wilderness.